It's time for a mail call. If that sounds interesting, stick around. Let's open some packages together because what else are you doing? It's hot out. At least it's hot out here. I'm actually filming right now on my, I'm, I get ready with me because I'm going to film a bunch of videos right in a row. I am trying to get all my living room cleared out before I go back to work tomorrow. And I'm actually working full time for two weeks, even though I'm a part-time employee and I'm going to be sitting through a lot of virtual meetings. So I'm going to try and get a little things organized right now so we got some packages to open we'll start with this one which is actually from jerry who is an awesome follower she sells on poshmark i will link her closet below uh if i remember because sometimes i say things and then i forget because i still haven't fixed my desktop so i'm doing everything on my phone and she sent me hold on Ooh, these super cute pair oh and the card the card fell down i'll get it in a second Oh, rag and bone. Super cute. So she sent me these white jeans. She said there is a stain on them somewhere and asked if I wanted to tie dye. And you know, I said, heck yes, I will tie dye me some rag and bone jeans. So those are going to go in my way over there pile, <laughs> which is for tie dyeing. I actually have a pile for tie dyeing and bleach dyeing and altering stuff. Hold on. Let me see what the card says. Oh, it's just a cute thank you. She is. Why you sent me? You sent me the card. She said, thanks for relieving me of the guilt of this item going to waste. Jerry, thank you for sending it to me. It was so sweet of you to think of me. I really appreciate it. And I really appreciate you watching the channel and commenting and always being super supportive. It's just, it makes me very happy. So, okay, so I've got boxes. Hold on, I feel like we're at a weird angle. I mean, always, I'm wearing this because I don't, I realized I was looking, I took you in my closet and realized this is for the other video probably, that I don't really know what to wear, but yeah shirts I need some help in the shirt game so I don't know what else We're, we've got five boxes I didn't think I ordered five things and then a couple of Amazon packages that I don't know what they are but I'm gonna see and if they're business related I'll show you I might show you anyway just for fun because I'm opening packages all right that one I realized after I did that that it has this cute little tear along thing oh, yeah super smart super smart what are you Oh, okay. Now I've got this cotton stuff from that package going everywhere. I, I didn't know there was white involved. Oh, those are the, okay. So I ordered a couple new masks. Everyone's like, don't you have cute fun masks? I'm like, I just want masks that work. And I have a couple, I have one mask actually. I bought some and I gave them to mom and dad from other people. Um, some that I got that were handmade just didn't work. They didn't fit well. They were too small on all of us, which was kind of a bummer. They're super cute, but they just didn't fit. And then a group that we got fit really well, but there's, I don't know. It's just, so I got a couple more masks. I guess that's not super interesting. And then we'll just get started with this box here that's right on top. Do, do, do. This box, the person, I need to tell her. It came with like the thing kind of ripped open. Uh, she said it was tracking while she was late and shipping it, she said which I totally forgot I'd even ordered it, which just, so that was fine. Uh, but then it never showed that it was tracking. It just said pending shipment scan. So, and then it showed up. So here we go. We got a box. I don't remember what's in any of these because like I said, I order and then I promptly forget because I just do. I blame it on premenopause, but I can't blame everything on premenopause, can I? Probably kid, but you know. Oh, all right. How are you doing lately? I don't know. Oh, cute. She got a little butterfly sticker on the inside. So she said she sent me a few little extras. I don't know what those are. While I appreciate like free gifts and stuff, it's kind of fun. I also don't like a lot of, I mean, despite the look of my living room and my house, I don't like a bunch of extraneous little stuff. I don't like cutesy stuff. I don't, so while I appreciate people sending me stuff in their boxes, if it's not something I specifically ordered, I get a little ooky about it, but she has really cute stuff in her closet, so we'll see what she sent. And there was no need. I mean, shipping stuff happens. I totally get that. So, but it was really sweet of her. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh, we got very, very pretty paper. Oh my gosh. Okay, so she's got, this is a napkin on top, which I should have. Okay, we've got a presentation here, people. Hold on, I got to show you this presentation. This is some, some serious posh wrapping. I don't know if I, I thought I'd ordered from her before, but I don't remember a package. Okay, so we've got little decals on every side. We've got this cute little napkin, which is, that's a great use for a little napkin. It's got a card with a cute little rhinestone bobby pin. 
Okay, and then I take off that layer. There's more to the layer. This is serious. I don't do this. It's gorgeous. It's like a present. I'm super excited to open it, but do I want to do that for all my packages? Heck to the no, to the no, no, no. But I will have to tell her her packaging is super fab. And most of it, it looks like it's probably repurposed or recycled stuff. So that's okay, I guess. I just, it's a lot of extraneous waste. I do package in Ziploc, like big Ziploc bags because I've had stuff get wet and I don't want people's items to get ruined, especially like leather goods or something that's higher quality. I don't want it to come to them soaking wet. So I do use plastic bags, they are reusable. And I've had people say, oh great, a reusable bag, I can reuse it. And I'm like, perfect, you're a posh person, reuse that bag for your storage. So it's just awkward because yeah, there's just so much waste involved in shipping. Okay, so this is super cute. Oh my gosh, hold on. Oh wow, I don't think I ordered that. Is that a, what is, no, that's paper. No, that's a bag. I did not order that there bag, but it's so, okay, I'm, I may not be mad at her for sending me extra things. I kind of love her, I think. Hold on. Okay, so super cute. All right, this is gonna take forever if everyone wraps their stuff like this. So I have five things. All right. Less talking, more unwrapping. Sorry, it's gonna jingle, jingle, jingle. Oh. All right, had Papa come to the door. So, so then it's wrapped in plastic and in tissue paper. This is very secure. It is not going to get damaged or stained, which I appreciate. It is also an ex Okay, this is really loud. Hold on, let me pause and unwrap this one. We did it. Oh my gosh, look at the cuteness of this little clutch. I think she put extra goodies inside. Hold on, this is serious. All right, so there are extra goodies inside. Let me pull, oh wow, she went over the top. I have got to write her a note. That's the reason why I wanted to film this now because I've been waiting to open my boxes just because. So this is just a Steve Madden bag, but look at that cute po color pop. It does have a couple little scuffs to the handle, which were disclosed in her listing, but isn't that just a chic bag? I think that's fab. I don't know. Okay, I have my glasses on, but they're, they're awkward. I might take them off. All right, where do I put these things? Oh, if you saw, if you watched my getting ready, okay, wow. There are presents. She did stuff me with presents and I think one of them I love. So let's just see what about these. She's wrapped them all as well as she wrapped the other ones. This whole video is just gonna be about one box because seriously, this woman is an excellent wrapper. I might need, where'd my scissors go? Seriously, I lost my scissors already. What, you can't take me anywhere. All right, what do we got here? Auto correct with caffeine, lutein, and horse chestnut. What is this? It, it's a little pouchy poo. So there's a pouch. Those look like two little cute bobby pins. Some hair dilly bobbers. I cannot use these at all on my hair. Oh, this is one, it's a fancy one. Those beads seriously eat my hair alive, so I can't use those. Uh, oh. Sunday Riley, I think I've heard of that before. A little sample, Mogul, what is this? Your Moga from Huda Beauty, Elemis, Collagen, Overnight Matrix, Overnight Matrix. There's a matrix in this package. I mean, seriously, I don't know about that. Uh, and then these, these are all things I probably should know about, but I don't, I've heard of some of them. Never tried them, so those are fun little samples. That's cute. Uh, Okay, hold on, let me get this back in here so I don't lose all this stuff. And the thing with stuff like this is I'm not gonna pass it along to my customers because no, the, the samples are fun. This little pouch is cute. It's probably supposed to be for like nail scissors or trimmers or something like that, but not really my jam. All right, hold on, let me put that down there. Super cute and her wrapping, I mean, look at this gold paper. If I were not, opening this for video, I'd be more careful and reuse the gold paper. Actually, this one came open really easily. There's a big chunk I can reuse there. I like reusing wrappings. I am the official wrapper for my family. My parents, seriously, starting by the time I was about 10, used to tape my Christmas packages shut and then have me wrap all of the presents for everyone. And I didn't peek because frankly, I like the surprise and I didn't want to ruin my own Christmas. But still, 
Yeah, I haven't wrapped pack <laughs> packages that well for a long time, but I used to put a lot of effort into it. Okay, we got a couple things here. Wow, okay. Oh, that's cute. That looks like a little, there's all this and it's in a thing. So let me open the thing. The thing is also taped, hold on. We got some serious wrapping. Again, this one video may just be about this box at this point because yeah. All right, I don't know. Oh, that's a cute little Brett. I do love Bretts. That's cute. All right, I can use that. I have not opposed that. Made in Taiwan. That looks vintage-y to me, but I could be wrong. All right, and this looks, what, a bracelet? Some shit. What is that? Ooh, bracelets. Okay, those are tiny. Bro. Those are going to fit like not me. <laughs> those are tiny. Unless it's something that, no, the coils. So those are fun. I will find a child to give those away to because as you can see, there is no way in Hades or heck those are adult bracelets. I mean, and I'm pretty good at getting my hand into a bracelet. I have a fairly standard size wrist. I mean, it's on the larger side of standard, but it is not big wrist and my hand not that big, but that not gonna fit me. You see what I'm saying? Okay, there's, there's this cute thing that looks like it's a pin. So let's see if I can get this open because seriously, the, the wrapping game here is intense. I'm kind of impressed. All right, hold on. Where on earth did I put my scissors? Seriously, how do I lose scissors? All right, I gotta put this wrapping over there. Oh, I found them. They're under the napkin. Awkward. Okay. So beautiful. She did such a good job. I mean, seriously, this is a beautiful presentation. I can't do this. I don't have the time or the inclination to do this, um, but I am super impressed with people who can. It just makes a fun experience. I mean, seriously, this is like Christmas in a bag. So this is Family Reunion 2015. Oh, but that's a really cute little tree pin. All right. So I'm not mad about that either. That's super cute. I used to wear brooches and pins a lot. I used to make brooches and pins a lot. I haven't for a while, but I'm kind of getting back into them. I think they will be coming back on trend. If not this fall, I say next year. Uh, I've, I've, I've seen some hints of them, but I think they might be coming back. So we got this one that we're opening. Let's see if I can slide that out without. Uh, what is that? Feels like another sample something. I think those samples were like good brands too, so that'll be fun to try. It means I have to wash my face more though. Okay, this is awkward. I'm filming this also. Uh, oh, did my iPad die? What is my iPad doing? It stopped filming. That's awkward. Hold on. Seriously. The iPad just fell over. This is an interesting day. I'm just saying. I'll be right back again. Okay. <laughs> Let's get back into this. I am so interested in this box. I really only ordered three things from her and so far we've unwrapped like five. Let's see, I'm gonna have to rip this one. It feels like a little sample. Ooh, it's not a little, what is this? Oh, fun. Uh, these are cute little wine charms. Uh, you know, when I got married, I bought like cute, martini glasses and all this. I thought I was gonna like be adult-like and have a little wine cabinet and have fun things for when people came over and I married an alcoholic and so we never had anyone come over and yeah, I never used any of the things. So at some point, maybe I'll have a cause to entertain at some point. All right, there we go. This is cute wrapping, I'll save that. So let's see, what is this? I don't think I ordered this either. So I really wanna see what's in it. This is fun, there are all these surprises. Like I said, this is definitely a lot of stuff she put in here. I, she did not need to. I totally understand, especially when people just don't get things shipped and she was super communicative about it, but it was nice of her to try and make me feel better. Oh, this looks fun. Rejuvenating natural extract, paraben and sulfate free green tea, vitamin A under eye strips. Oh, you know I need those. I mean, I'm seriously a raccoon and I don't wear any of the makeups or put on the base, so that doesn't help. Oh, those are cool. I'll look forward to trying those. All right, again, I'm not mad about the extras at all. They're super fun. What do we got here? Oh, 
These little decals are super cute. I kind of want to save them and use them for something, but I don't know what. What is in here? Is this something I ordered? I don't feel like this is something I ordered, but it's... Wow. Girl, what are you doing? I'm going to have to link your closet down below too. I'm not sure she's going to... She's going to... <laughs> This is a never ending unboxing. Literally, there I'm obviously gonna be filming two unboxings right now. That wasn't really the plan. I thought there were like three things in here and maybe like a, an extra sticker. There are more than there's more than an extra sticker. Okay, hold on. Let's see if I can get this here. But this looks cute. What is this? Huh, let's see what this is. Oh, a little tissue. That's super handy. I got in the habit of carrying these in China because they don't often have toilet paper in the bathrooms along with sanitary wipes. I mean like, you know, like hand sanitizer wipe kind of things. So this, some little, this is handy. Have in your bag, I guess. And what is this? I'm interested in this. Let me put the, ooh, this looks like a cute little nail polish. Look at that. It's teeny tiny. How adorable is that? Again, I have not done my nails. I'm, oh, I really... I get pedicures in the summer and I love them so much, but I haven't gotten any this year for obvious reasons. And I miss the having the cute toes and also the not um, awkward feet, you know, because especially I wear flip flops when I work in the garden. So it's just not a pretty sight. I'm just throwing that out there. Like you needed to know that. Apparently this is the day of oversharing. Hopefully, mm, stopped filming again. Ellen Tracy. Look at how cute that is. That's a super fun, shimmery color. I love that. And that stopped filming. All right, well, that's okay. You don't need to watch me unbox all the things. I'm just gonna keep going with this one because otherwise, I'm, if I keep getting up and down and never going to get stopping, I do need to get a table to use. Okay, wow. All of this fun stuff. Seriously? All right, let's just put her name. We'll just put her name on here and get a rip it off. It's down there. It fell down. I will tell you her closet name. Hold on. Where'd it go? This is, uh, no, that's not it. Is that? Maybe. That doesn't have a closet name. It has my name on it. All right, awkward. I'll look it up and I'll put it here somewhere. Cause seriously, one, she had really good prices. She had a good deal going on. She had some fun things. So the Steve Mad bag was the only thing that I've unboxed so far that I actually ordered, but you know, we're getting there. This little bag is cute. Hold on, let me look, show you this cute little bag. I don't have a good makeup bag actually. I like that it's patent leather. It's very roomy. That's a cute little useful thing. All right. Can't be mad about the extras if I'm gonna use them. Uh, this is an Ulta moisturizer, a gentle, mild moisturizer that increases hydration of the skin. My hands are like working in the garden. Seriously, they're cracked and disgusting. I don't know if you can see that, but my hands are not, they have none of the cuteness in the summer, especially. So that's useful. Uh, matrix, another matrix. I feel like, Ooh, this is conditioner and shampoo. So cute little, uh, samples. Those are great for traveling. If I get to do that ever again in my life, that will be fun. I love to travel. Uh, I haven't been anywhere since I got back from China because of mom. And then now the current situation. Ooh, this is fun. I always like having a nail file anywhere because if I break a nail, I hate it. It drives me crazy. So this is a little diamond nail file. Cute. All right. So it's a box of never ending prisons. Seriously. We still haven't gotten to the other two things I ordered. I don't remember what they were, but we haven't gotten there. Oh my gosh. Wow. Okay. Oh, are those earrings? No. Those are just cute little bracelets. And those will fit. You see, you see a normal bracelet fits normally, but those, those are cute. Just little bead bracelets. Those are a fun thing to throw in free. If you order something from me and you want bracelets, I'm not really wearing bracelets. Oh, I almost dropped things. Hold on. This is just a cute little bead bracelet with silver, kind of like faux turquoise. It looks like maybe ceramic. I'm not gonna take it out of its package because that would take even longer. 
I'm opening this now. This is lining a table, so you can see me open the things. All right. Okay, what is this? Ooh, a brooch. Ew, are you? You are plastic, probably. You don't feel like hematite. Uh, just a little plastic brooch. That's super cute. Yeah, there's some scraping off of the coloring on the plastic, so you can tell it's plastic. That's cute. Just a little vintage brochy. Or vintage wannabe brooch, but it's probably vintage. It looks like it. Okay, what is this gorgeousness? Are these bracelets? Are these are bracelets? A necklace? What is Hold on, it's tied. I will untie the tie. Oh my gosh. Seriously, people. What is my life right now? The problem with this is it means I have to film an extra video and I don't have time. Um, are these like Murano, wannabe Murano? Oh, they are. There we go. Those are very pretty. I actually love, it looks like either it's stretched out or there's a bead that's broken off is what it looks like there. Uh, probably just that it's stretched because these all match. So yeah, I can probably figure out how to fix that. That's really cute. It's just got a lobster claw clasp. Oh, it has a name. Oh, it's Lane Bryant. It says right there. I found a little namey thing. Can you see that? Probably not, but there we go. I can't help you with the hand behind because I'm trying to hold the box on my lap all at the same time. All right, so we did that. I'm gonna need a garbage bag. Okay, nothing there. Okay, so now we get to this thing, which is looking super interesting to me. Like, I thought this was paper. Hold on, I'll show you. So I thought this was paper. I think it's a bag, which is super fun. Uh, it is. Let's see, what's it from? Nationwide Children's... It's a hospital! Okay, well, I love the prints. I don't know that I'm carrying around a hospital tote, but look at that. That's cute. All right, everything else is in here. I think that's it. I'll put this down. There's a note, I'll read her note eventually, but probably not in this video because yeah, this video is gonna be long enough as it is. All right. Oh, there's, I was like, what? I thought I ordered two things. I did, the other thing is in here, I think. Hold on, get, oh, oh, it, it's in the zip front pocket. That's why I was so, I was like, I feel it, but I can't get to it. Um, this is so cute. I don't, when your child needs a hospital, everything matters. I don't know that I want to, I mean, I don't know. But yeah, that's a cute little tote. Someone will definitely love it. All right, what is here? Oh, maybe I'll wear this for one of my other videos. So this is possibly for me and possibly to resell. This is just a Calvin Klein size 1X, but I love the green. And I was just talking about needing things to film in if you watched my get ready with me it is like the roll tab which i hate because they never stay in place but i don't have to roll them up i like to because oh that needs washed i can't wear it today all right never mind i'll wash it we'll be gone okie dokie and the last thing the thing that i finally actually ordered sorry for the crinkling it's there's more crinkling, hold on. Haha! -ha! I got it. What is this? What did I order? This is Bethany size extra. Oh, it's a dress! It's Bethany extra large. It's a vintage, is what it looked like. Dress? I don't know. Tunic dress? What did I order? It's super cool. It's like fleece though. It's, I don't know if it's vintage. It may not be vintage. I could be lying. Uh, it's just this really long, it has kind of a handkerchief hem detail. It's fleecy, I don't know. I just thought it looked cute and I wanted something to go, like I said, I don't, I don't like buying just one thing when I order. So I'd found the bag. Well, I found the shirt and I wanted the shirt for me. Then I found the bag, I was like, I can add that in. And then I found this, I was like, okay, I can add this in, why not? This can be washed and laid flat to dry. I don't think this is vintage. It looked vintage. I don't think it's vintage. All right. 
Whew, we did it. If you are still with me after that, I think I'm gonna go get a drink of water before I start opening. I have three more boxes and hopefully none of them have that many items in them because they shouldn't. And then an Amazon box I might throw in there just in case. So thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed this video. What, what do you think? So let me know your opinions. How do you like your items packaged when you order stuff from Poshmark? Do you like the cutesy packaging with all of this stuff? I mean, this was bells and whistles and the kitchen sink. It was all thrown in there and it was so cute. It was really cute. It was a lot of stuff I don't need. There's some things I will totally use though. So I appreciate it. Thank you so much, by the way. I have, I still don't remember your closet name and I can't look because I'm filming on my phone, which is where I look in my eye. Anyway, it's a thing. I hope everything's going well with you. You're out there making the world a better place and I will see you in just a little bit and I'm not gonna change because this was supposed to be the unboxing video outfit. So now I'm just gonna keep it on when we do two unboxing videos in a row. I'll see you later, alligators.